A Prince George's County business owner is asking for the public's help. Why? He needs help in finding a storage trailer that was storing equipment from his batting cage business that was all stolen. This was caught on camera, and as Fox 5's David Kappel explains, they are desperate for information on this. Andre Hockaday is the owner of on deck batting cages here in Prince George's County. He's in the process of renovating this location. While he's doing that, he was keeping about $20,000 worth of equipment in a trailer parked in that spot right there. He tells me he usually does have the safety pin in the hitch to make sure that the trailer cannot be stolen. Acknowledges he did not do that last Friday night, but about an hour after he left, he says the trailer was stolen. Just start all over, I guess. Mm -hmm. Frustration from Andre Hockaday, who says this is the only batting cage for kids in Prince George's County. Now, an estimated $20,000 of equipment gone in the dead of night. Turf, pitching machines, uh, nets, baseballs, ba um, baseball bats, helmets. This is surveillance video taken just after midnight last Saturday. It shows the parked trailer, then a dark pickup truck that appears to be a Dodge parks next to it. Someone gets out of the truck, takes a lap around the trailer, then eventually hooks the trailer up and drives off. Hockaday posted the video to social media looking for help, adding that very few people knew the trailer had equipment in it. I was just waiting on if anybody else knew it, but I didn't know. I don't know who it is. Um, and so far, nobody else knows. Hockaday eventually called Prince George's County Police, who took a report and are investigating. In the meantime, he's asking anyone who recognizes the person or the truck from the surveillance video to reach out as he tries to figure out what's next. I don't know. I'm going to put it in God's hands and let him handle it. All right, so $20,000 worth of equipment. We did ask Hockaday about insurance. He tells me that because the trailer was parked off site, it will not be fully covered, adding to his sense of urgency to get that equipment back. Back to you.